Welcome back. Jillian Morgan here, bringing you another episode of EDU in 90. According to the World Health Organization, roughly 15% of the world's population lives with some disability, so many students, as well as their teachers and parents, rely on visual, audio, and other types of accommodations to absorb learning material. And accommodations like these often benefit all students, so it's important to keep them top of mind. That's right. Earlier this season, we looked at accessibility features that are built into Chrome to accommodate individual learning styles. On this episode, we'll learn about a couple of the ways educators can use G Suite for Education tools to make learning accessible for every student. Using G Suite, educators can design learning experiences that are accessible to all students, and closed captions in Google Slides are a great place to start. Closed captions are on-screen text that include subtitles and text representations of sound. Turning on captions to presentations ensures that students who are deaf or hard of hearing can access the content in real time. Check out this example. Three and three times four equals 12. 12 is the common denominator. Captions are also a great way to support English as a new language learners, as well as any viewer who wants to follow along or watch when sound isn't an option. So how can you, as a teacher, set this up for your students? Great news, it comes built in. To have live captions appear during a presentation, start by opening Google Slides in a Chrome browser. Once you've confirmed your microphone is on and working, begin presenting your slides. Then, to turn captions on, click the CC button. As you speak, captions will appear at the bottom of your screen. For students with different visual needs, teachers and students can take advantage of alternative text, commonly known as alt text. Alt text is a text description in the code of a page that's used to describe the appearance or function of an image. If a document or presentation includes images, users of screen readers may hear only the word image unless you add alt text. Docs, sheets, slides, and sites all make it really easy to set up or edit pre-existing alt text. With alt text, screen reader users will hear a relevant description of the image, and anyone who hovers over the image will also benefit from the useful description. Those are just two ways you can make your class presentations and materials more accessible. Check out the links in the description below for more about how G Suite accessibility tools can help you reach all learners. There, you'll find Google for Education's accessibility site, which includes setup guides, teacher tips, training resources, product support, and more to help you create inclusive learning environments. Tell us in the comments below which accessibility features you use with your students and what tools you'd like to see in the future. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next EDU in 90. Expeditions, Education on Air, and more. Check out our last episode for updates from across Google for Education.